Hey everybody, Stevie T here. Um, so I just got back from the weekend in Northeast. I had an awesome show. Met so many awesome people. And um, as always, I just thank everybody for their patronage and their support. It really means a lot to me. And I love that, you know, connecting with people who believe in the same things as far as the gemstones go, um, as I do. It was very interesting, as always. Um, so I did come home with, well, I was at the show and I, and I wrapped and made some things while I was there and, um, it doesn't always happen, but it happened this time. So I want to show off what I got. Um, I also, first I want to start off, I got some geo agates, <laughs> geo agate slices and on the way over to this table right now, I, well, they fell and some really pretty ones that I was gonna wrap are different now. We'll call it different. They're just different. And I don't know, I'm kinda sad, but I'm but you know what's what's funny is over um you know, if you go on my Facebook um there's pictures of a like what happened was I had this big purple agate slice and I dropped it on Saturday night and I had to show on Sunday again and so um, the piece that broke I ended up being able to wire wrap it and make it really 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 pretty uh, but mm, so sad <laughs> these just broke um, let me just show off what's what's still around this is gorgeous this, you can see all of the, like, bubbles up. It's, like, bubbling up from the ocean. It's pretty cool. So, I have to go quickly because my um, battery is going to die. And this one would be a cool one to wrap. I just want to show that off. And I'm going to wrap these. Um, if, if I was thinking while I was over at where I got these at, I would have gotten two of them so I could make earrings of each citrine and amethyst but i didn't think that way i just grabbed it um here's another cool one i'll wrap soon awesome awesome okay let's get moving um i wrapped this at the show and there are photos of this online but i just wanted to do video so everybody can see all the different facets and ways that it is and i got the om symbol for god um at the show, and these um, ribbon necklaces too, or organza necklaces. Um, here's a cool quartz that I wrapped while I was at the show. And I put a little um, rose quartz right there. Yep, it's pretty, pretty cool. It feels really good. Okay. Uh, next, uh, we have some sea sediment jasper. I believe that's what it is. Um, wow, it's like the world, doesn't it? It is amazing. This piece is so blue. But um, I think it's a Jasper. I mean, that's what the back of it had said when I purchased it. And it just gives me good feelings. I don't even care what it's called. So sorry, I don't have the um, official, official name, if that's not official. And I got an Ammonite, A M M. O-N-I-T-E. It's a Nautilus fossil. Isn't that cool? And you can see, let me get the light in there. So you can see the little crystals in this part right here. Nope. It's not catching up. Anyway, it's pretty cool. It has a slight one in the middle. And it has two. One right there and one right there. Highlighting them with the lights. Bam. Um... It also has an OM symbol on it. Love it. I made a floating necklace. Um, a high, um, how light dyed purple. It kind of looks like clay, but it's not. It's, it's how light. And I put some quartz um, chips in between there. And it's it's a fan shape. And yeah, so it look cool. Like it's floating on your neck. I like illusions, and I like to play around with illusions. Um, here's one that I got in wrapped. Mm. So, you have the pictures, and now you have 
the live action feed camera. Here's one. I really liked. I really enjoyed doing this one. I really like this piece a lot. I'm not going to keep it. I'm going to sell it. And I, I can't possibly keep everything that I make. You know, part of what art is and what you do is you share it. Share it with people. This. I haven't made a gemstone necklace in a few days and it seems like an eternity. But take a look at this pendant. It even has like little raised like etchings and things. You know, this is really pieced together as like fossilized kind of... Um, yeah, you can see all the... Um, cuts in there um sea sediment i do believe and as tall as also a jasper which is plausible because jasper is so um um widespread so i have green aventurine on here i've got some shells i have a sodalite i call them coins because they're a little sodalite coin i have blue moss agate and I have some more blue moss agate, and I have some peridot, and some bamboo, and some like uh, porcelain, I think, and some serpentine, I do believe, and these little two little leaves, and some tiger's eye, and some abalone shells, and a tiny, tiny, tiny ball of unikite right there. So tiny. But that's that. I love it. Okay. Anything that's like the jungle, I love, but. Here's a Jasper arrowhead. I'm gonna just put it on a simple rubber cord. The om symbol of the Tibetan monks. And here I took the blue lace agate raw that I had and I white wrapped it. You saw that as a pendant earlier and now it is on a necklace. I decided to do more of these um, for, you know, the girly girly or just like someone can't have really a lot of gemstones around their neck and they just feel like claustrophobic or something. Um, this is uh, moss agate and you can see right through the edge, see right there? And you can see all the little strands of the where is it? I believe you can see it. Um, of all that, the seaweed that was like caught in the resin when it was heating up, heating up in the in the earth. So that's cool. Um, I did take some non gemstone things I made. Um, Swarovski crystal with a swan bale. Cannot beat Swarovski. Swar blah, Swarovski crystals. Um, and the ice pick bail. Can't really tell how shiny, shiny, shiny that is, but super, super is. It is super, super shiny. Um, I also had this Swarovski. I had these for like weddings, and I didn't really have any people getting married, so I decided over the weekend to. Sorry about that. To put this on there. See how awesome that is. Swarovski is a big deal. Shines for days and days and days. Okay, and what else do I have? I have the um, turquoise wrapped and on um, a nice blue, powder blue. Baby powder blue. Yes, so this is all my new stuff and it'll be up soon at stevietinspiredjewelry.com and i hope that you enjoyed it this the video and the sneak peek of everything and if you know how to put this back together with your mind any of you that are watching could you please have this put together when i wake up to my tomorrow morning i'd really appreciate it <laughs> namaste everybody